Okay, this is the final part of it. So, you just be yourself. Uh, do what you like. Don't have anyone tell you that you're a man for, or a woman. I mean, I bet you female the men will say, well, you're a, man, a woman because you do women things. And, you know, it's habit. It's also a habit thing. But it's also who you are that makes who you are. I mean, I'm transsexual. I like Pokemon dolls. I like smoking the pipe. The cigars, watching uh, polit political movies, reading political books, uh, learning about the U.S. government, uh, how governments run. I mean, I read, I have my own ideas. I like Sherlock Holmes. I like uh, television shows like Bones and uh, CSI and Law and Order and Ghost Whisperer and etc., etc., down the list. Why? And I'm a classic gamer as well as I like classic TV shows like Magnum P.I., Airwolf, uh, A-Team, stuff like that in my era. I call it classic. I've even seen stuff like Leave it to Beaver and uh, other things. My Three Sons all the way back to the 50s with Mikhail's Navy. Stuff like that. Thing is, is I am just myself. So I like a good bourbon now and then or a good scotch. Big whoop, you know. So the bottom line is be yourself. Don't have anyone tell you differently, and if someone tells me I am a man, or I'm a nutcase, why don't you uh, wake up, smell what you're shoveling, because uh, frankly, I'm tired of people uh, sending me messages because I'm just myself. Do you understand it? Someone like myself with learning disabilities, um, mild retardation, uh, and, uh, and I'll say this, Aaron thinks I'm more a uh, woman than a lot of the transsexuals, but no, I'm just myself. I mean, I can't say I'm more woman than everyone thinking about it, being here in Cleveland. I uh, said it a while ago, but truthfully, I'm not. It's like uh, the rich. The rich could say they're richer because, well, they're better than us because they got millions of dollars. Well, the rest of us poor people are poor. That is what they call the class system. I can go into details of the class system, but what's the freaking point? You get what I'm saying? So, before you tell me I'm not wearing a dress... Or a skirt, which, by the way, the other day I was uh, looking at some Gungan, and I was looking at a nice, short, and long leather skirt. Aaron said that would be really cool, you know? So, Aaron's got his head on straight. When I'm not drinking, I have my head on straight, too. So, uh, I try to cut these videos short. I try to cut these videos down so I don't uh, barbecue many people. I have a problem barbecuing some people because they just have to learn, you know? But today... Doing my uh, MySpace video, I decided to say this. The key to being happy is being yourself. The key to being yourself is not to deceive. My beef is not with the transsexuals who uh, are born in the wrong body and uh, go for it. My beef is the ones that deceive, don't want to tell their partners they used to be male or female. And here's a big one. My other beef is, and I'm against it, and a lot of people know this. Otherwise, you'd see me down the street walking along with my cane. I'm a great person to talk to. I have no beef with others. But the other thing is, is and then here's a big one. Uh, transsexuals that know you and help you and support you and say, Oh, yeah, you'll have your surgery soon, hon. You know, and they get their surgery and then it's like, Oh, well, I'm a woman now. Get rid of you. You're useless. You're a piece of crap because, uh, you know, I can get to go get a guy and see how my new vagina feels with a penis in it and stuff like that. That is, you know, something I do not like. They ditch their friends after they've had their surgery. They do not want to be near other trannies because they let them people know that they're tranny too. So they try to blend in and have all these cosmetic surgeries, but they're not themselves. I mean, hell. Uh, if I was going to go through a uh, surgery, a surgeon uh, uh, that's, uh, for example, smoke cigars, I'd be like, hey, doc, let's go smoke a cigar and discuss this over a nice cigar and a single malt. Why? That is me, for example. I mean, come on. I mean, literally, I am just myself, you know. That, that, that is why I'm against uh, that aspect of it. Otherwise, I'm for it. Heck. I'm also like a hermit in many ways, too. I mean, I don't want to be bothered, but when I do have to be bothered, you know, I'm a good person to uh, deal with, you know. But the thing is, a lot of people think I'm a nutcase because I'm against deception and I'm against uh, <clears throat> transsexuals who 
ditch their friends because they've had the surgery and they're better than others. We are all God's creatures. We are all one people. We are one type. We are one uh, one universe. You know, the problem is, is like I said, they just deceive. So, um, bottom line is, I don't like that. I don't like the fact that they uh, think they're better than people and they think that everyone else who's not uh, post-operative is uh, uh, like them, a woman, because, you know, that they they do things like uh, uh, carry a gun or listen to a police scanner or smoke a pipe or enjoy cigars or smoke cigarettes. I mean, there's a lot of people out there that are just themselves. And the point is, is be yourself. All right? And don't toss away your friends because you're, you're hanging out with uh, transsexuals like yourself. No, just accept it. You know, move on. Now, there's other places. You know, I've seen it all over uh, the United States. I've seen it online where as soon as someone got a surgery, they get rid of all their training friends and they try to make a normal life like, oh, yes, uh, you know, whatever. <clears throat> now... Uh, I've told a friend of mine who's uh, beautiful, attractive, who's uh, a nice blonde lesbian, like, younger than me. I think she's 24. Hmm. Anyways, to be yourself. She agrees. Being yourself is the key to being yourself, you know. So, be yourself. Don't deceive. And don't toss away your friends. And don't think you're better than others. I live in a community where I'm poor. I live in a Spanish community. There's like five transsexuals there. They're all themselves. Me? I'm myself. I get along with a lot of people. People that don't get along with me are the ones that probably hate me because I'm transsexual. The rest of you out there that understand what I'm saying is be yourself and don't poke fun at me or poke me and say I'm a crackpot, a nut job, uh, etc. because I'm not. I am just being myself and I'm outspoken probably in the transsexual community for what I believe in, but this is only my beliefs. Now, if you want, <clears throat> here's a big one, to deceive, so be it. But if your partner ever finds out and beats the living crap out of you, never mind you have said in previous videos, yes, you deserve it, blah, blah, blah. You don't deserve to be murdered, you don't deserve to have the crap kicked out of you, and you don't deserve to commit suicide. At times, I've told a friend of mine, I pulled out the gun for demonstration that uh, certain things need to be done or you guys need to plug yourself. I didn't mean it. I was drunk and basically uh, outspoken at the time. The bottom line is no suicide. I lost a transgendered partner. Suicide. My wifey. I lost, uh, you know, a lot in my life. I'm poor. So, when I live my life, I live my life to the best of my knowledge and to the best of my ability. And when I speak, I speak from my heart, which is, be yourself, don't deceive, uh, don't throw away your friends, and try to be normal, you know. So, and yes, I am outspoken, but now you understand why. Hopefully I don't have to uh, make any more videos anytime soon on YouTube, except for you pipe smokers out there that followed me this far and wondering what's going on, my friends. I got some reviews to make on like 10 tobaccos, which I will get to uh, in the next couple weeks. Alright? Alright. Take it easy, you all. Oh, and for you pipe smokers out there, look for my friend uh, Aaron. Uh, and he'll uh, be making some new videos, too. That's my partner. For the rest of you, peace. And to the transgendered community, now you understand my, uh, my uh, thoughts and abilities. So take it easy and uh, no hard feelings. Leave comments. And no, I'm not a crackpot. Peace.